I'm Deborah, and this is Cool in Your Zip, the show that we feature pretty cool places right here in Phoenix. We're at the Music Instrument Museum right here in the 050. I'm with Heidi. Tell me why this place is so cool. Well, first, thanks so much for coming. We're actually in the world's only global musical instrument museum, which is pretty cool. We have over 6,500 instruments on display, cutting edge technology where you can see everything. And it's also literally cool because we have to protect our instruments from the desert heat. So make sure you bring a light jacket next time. Oh, absolutely. And I want to tell you, this is nestled in the northeast, kind of in my neck of the woods, right off the 101, the 51. And it's a national museum. Yeah, it absolutely is. We're nationally ranked. Uh, TripAdvisor has us as the top 20 museums in the country. And of course, we're the number one attraction uh, uh, for Phoenix as well. Oh, this, that is so cool. Now, with this, we're in a very special exhibit. Tell me what we're at right now. So we're in Dragons and Vines. And, and what's so special about this, first of all, it's the only time these instruments have been displayed to the public. And after this, they go back in the vault. So it's really important to, to get here before September uh, for those that haven't seen it. But these instruments are actually inlaid. So, so if you look at the design, and by the way, you get a flashlight when you come in. You have to have a flashlight, OK. And the reason is because of the chatoyance. And that is basically that cat eye effect that this mother of pearl and a lot of the Beautiful. other precious materials have yeah so you can actually look at all of that detail and it's it's inlaid by hand by these artisans uh, and they're really it's the incredible. greatest in, in the country uh, in the world it's incredible now we've talked about these instruments you have so many interests you're representing like 200 countries plus yep. uh, great place for a field trip for kids to come uh, who comes here on a daily basis yeah so the best part about MIM is that there really is something for everybody but you did mention school kids and, and we welcomed about uh, 65,000 school tour participants just last year and we're hoping to get even more this year and the reason why it's so special is because they learn about music geography culture culture, everything. And then, of course, we get families and other people in as well. Traditions, and like, I've been here a few times, and I absolutely love it. I love all the different countries it represents. Some of the countries I've never even heard of. Over 200. And, and they, how they evolve the instrument from where it first started and where it is. And then you can kind of see a lot of it, how they kind of tie in together. The world ties in together through That's music. right, that's right. You get to celebrate differences, but you also get to see how really, really unique and different cultures are actually really similar in a lot of ways. Okay, you have concerts. Talk a little bit about that. So we have over 200 150 concerts a year and our theater is so intimate and perfect there's not a bad seat in the house there's about 300 seats but I'll tell you it's actually 299 because uh, at 300 we would have had to put a center aisle in well, we didn't want that we wanted perfect seating so 299 seats in our perfect theater with with really great uh, acoustic settings and and really great shows well I gotta tell you I've been here a couple times for some of those concerts and there is not a bad seat in the house but you do have to book early you do have to book early. They sell out. Okay. Uh, big, but big shows. You could also be a member. You can Tell me about absolutely the membership. be a member. Okay. And so what's really special about that is you get all kinds of uh, benefits throughout the museum. We also just started um, our very own magazine called Quarter Notes. And uh, you guessed it, it comes out quarterly. Oh uh, my gosh. And it's full of stories and, and all kinds of things that are happening around the museum. I love, um, love, love. So we are gonna, we want people to come check it out. Yeah. There's an interactive place for kids and families and all that good stuff. Thanks again, Heidi, for having us here. This place is so cool. It's the MIM, the Music Instrument Museum, and the Zero Five zero. Now that's cool in your zip. We want to know what's cool in your zip. Email us your cool places with the Phoenix zip code at coolinyourzip at phoenix.gov.